and action! <laughs> I know someone is going to hate me in the comments, but this is another foreigner way, guys. On the tongue, do that. What fuss? Make a one of us. Do y'all see my hair? Do y'all see my hair? Do you see why I'm acting a fool? Do you see my hair? Do you do you see my hair? Did you see that? Did you see it? Did you see her? Did you see her? Did you see her? Did you like my All I got to say is fuck what's your back to my channel this is Lex Marie with another video welcome to my channel welcome to my channel welcome to my welcome to my welcome to my channel hey welcome to my channel welcome to my channel welcome to my welcome to my welcome to my channel hey welcome to my welcome to my welcome to my channel hi guys welcome back to my channel this is Lex Marie with another video today I'm going to be reviewing this beautiful unit that I got from Lavi Hair um, this is a 22 inch Brazilian curly uh, virgin hair unit you guys already know the vibes um this is probably gonna be my next summer go-to i'm sorry i'm sorry i said the last one was my summer go-to but i changed my mind again so today i'm just gonna show you guys how it looks when it comes out of the package what it comes with how i install it and then just like the pros and cons on this wig but before that make sure that you subscribe to my channel Press the button right there, right there, right there, right there. Because I know some of you guys watch my videos and literally forget to subscribe. And it's okay. I forgive you. I forgive you if that was you and you for forgot to subscribe because you're watching a video and then just got all hooked. And you know, it's okay. It's okay. I'm not mad. But this is the time to subscribe right now and make sure that you like this video. If you do want to see more content like this, please let me know in the comment section down below. I love to get different ideas for videos. But after you finish subscribing, let's just let's just hop into the video. <laughs> All right. So uh, the hair that I am going to be reviewing today is from Lavi Hair. This is their 130 percent density Brazilian deep curly lace frontal wig in 22 inches. So. Um, I'm just now opening the product, but it comes like this in a bag. It's very cute. I believe the material is satin. Girl, I don't even know. <laughs> but it's a nice material similar to the Ali Pearl wig that I got. So this is how it comes. They come with their contact information in the bag and their logo and just saying that it's Brazilian virgin hair. I don't think there's anything else oh yes I have a coupon they have all their codes for Instagram snapchat and just hair care tips for the wig there is also a hair piece right here it says sexy I'm probably not gonna wear it but I just like the little details that they sent as well so that is putting them in my good graces. Now let's see the hair. Wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. So this is the hair. This, it's like, it's like kinky. Look at, look at the curls. It looks like spring twists, almost when they're unraveled. Okay, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. So recently I did review a wig from Amazon by Ray Leak and their vendor and the curls were very nice but they were not as coiled as this. This is giving... I thought it had a smell. But this is giving me very juicy jerry curls almost but I'm very excited to do this review because I think it's gonna look very natural and very you know foreign you know, very exotic so let's see what it comes with this wig I believe is a 13 by 4 
Yeah, it looks like a 13 by 4 lace. It has two combs for the middle of the head and then one comb in the center of the head and then there's one comb in the back. So you guys already, if you have been watching my videos, you know how I install my wigs. If you do want to see that specifically how I install my wigs to have a seamless look make sure that you check it in the description box because I'm probably gonna link that video down there and I'll link it up here in a card but I'm just gonna put this wig on off camera for you guys and then just style it and stuff so you guys can see how I put this on but I'm very excited it has adjustable straps the lace looks like it's blonde like not it's not transparent, but it has a little bit of a tint to it. So I'm curious how that's going to look with my brown wig cap. So let's just see how it looks and I'll get back to you guys when it's on my head. All right, so the wig is glued down. I am going to fix the front with some foundation. It doesn't really have bleach or anything on it. I just kind of tinted the lace with my Maybelline full coverage foundation, but Right now, I'm just going to separate the wig and give myself, I wanna say, should I give myself a side part or a middle part? I always do a middle part. But I look cute with a side part. Well, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. We're gonna first try a middle part and see how that looks. I feel like I should switch it up, you know? Let's see. <laughs> I look crazy, y'all. Um, I don't know, like. I don't know. All right, I'm just going to make an executive decision and try something new and give myself a side part. I'm not gonna make it too deep, but I'm just going to give it a try for this curly look. I can always switch it up, but I think I'm gonna give myself a side part. So now that my hair is parted, what I'm going to do is use my hot comb just to make sure that the hair is fully laid down on that side. I'm going to then cut the baby hairs and use my mousse to kind of swoop them down and then just spray my hair to see how these curls look when they're wet. So I'm just going to be using my Argan Oil from Morocco Cream of Nature Liquid Gold Shine and Style Foaming Mousse. I'm just going to use like that much, like two pumps, and just place it on the front of my head just so I can style my baby hairs and they don't look crusty like they normally do. <laughs> I try to come up with different methods every time I do my hair so that my looks don't always look the same but I see a lot of people do use mousse and it looks so natural and so nice so I'm just going to give it a try for this look Now I'm just going to use the hot comb to just lightly lay the hair down on top. That's going to be the same place that I put my powder for that part. So now this is the fun part where I spray my hair. Okay. So I'm just going to be using water with a little bit of conditioner. Um, I use a spray bottle on my natural hair as well just to add some moisture to my hair but oh stripping <laughs> I'm just gonna spray my hair down as much as I can 
and then I'm going to put my fingers through it make sure that all the water is in there and then I'm going to use my brush to see how these curls look when they are wet all right this is important so I am getting some shedding as you can see right here I have not used a comb yet and I'm already starting to get some shedding with the wig hopefully it's just you know a little bit but that's kind of all a red flag if I'm just running my fingers through the hair so as you can see these are the curls when they're wet they're very beautiful okay I am getting a little bit of shedding but it might just be because the curls were clumped up together but I'm gonna show you guys how this looks when it's wet and the curls are more defined in just a second but I need to go for a while because it's gonna take a long time all right so now the wig is on and I'm just adjusting my baby hairs before I do my makeup but the curls guys the curls are crazy the in a good way the girl the curls are crazy crazy let me show you guys these curls are crazy 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 I absolutely love the curl pattern on this wig like this is kind of like the pattern I was looking for something that could be low-key believable at least in my eyes I don't know in y'all eyes but this is giving me very 3c very 3b like this is giving me you know is this her hair you know is that your hair no babe <laughs> no babe <laughs> no it's not but it, it is technically cuz you know I bought it but this is this is cute this is so freaking cute so let me just do my makeup and give you guys my final review on the hair okay so I upped the lighting as you can tell um your girl was doing it basically in the dark to show you you know everything raw but this is how the hair is looking you see do you do you see what I mean do you see how beautiful this curl pattern like this might be my new favorite. I know I said the last one was my favorite, but this one might be my new favorite. It might be, it might be. Let me give you some pros and cons on this wig. Um, some really, really good pros is the pattern, the curl pattern of this hair. The curl pattern of this hair is exactly what I've been looking for, you know, my whole life, you know, it's just like, oh, you're the one I'm looking for, you know. I don't know what song that is, but <laughs> this is the wig that I have been basically looking for. The length is absolutely perfect for me. It goes right where, right above my chest, so it's not too, too long. And it goes to the center of my back. Another pro would probably be, just I guess how it takes water and how it takes product. It doesn't feel like it's weighed down. It feels still very flowy, very airy. So I would say that is also a pro. Uh, issue that I do see coming in the future, it's not necessarily a con, but just the shedding. I did have a little bit of shedding when I was combing out the hair, but when I switch brushes to my paddle brush, as you guys know, this is my signature paddle brush. I bring it everywhere I go, to class, to church, to the grocery store, <laughs> everywhere. But I use that brush and I did not have any more shedding, like at all. So I think it just kind of depends on what products or what um, tools that you use. But yeah, I don't really have any strong cons. I guess a con would be is the texture of the lace and the front of the hair I did not pluck the hair at all just to give you a raw view of what the hair is like however I wish that the lace was a little bit thinner so you did not see the indentation of the unit something that I do do is that I darken the lace and I'm gonna just do it a little bit more because I see it could be a little darker and that definitely helps with the discoloration of this lace on dark skin but guys I love this I love this wig I you guys already know I like curly hair for the summertime but I love this wig I'm probably going to do a like one month update on this hair but I don't have any complaints as of now this is the perfect pattern this is the perfect color it's the perfect style and I'm so glad I chose a side part because I always do a middle part I'm so basic but I I enjoy it I like this side part for me 
to finish off my look though I am going to put on my real fine beauty headband I love this headband it is velvet plush baby pink and I think it would go very nice with my outfit today I'm wearing a very pink outfit but if you do want to know where I got this headband please check out the description box and check out this company because this headband is giving like 90s 2000 glam uh, the last time I probably wore a headband was like middle school and they used to hurt on my head because I have a large head mm, don't don't come for me I kind of just exposed myself there so don't come for me but this is very plush so I think it fits any size head so this is a good finisher accessory for this look but please let me know how you guys enjoyed this hair again if you want to see it up close this is how the hair looks up close. Wasn't I right? It's giving you very 3C, 3B. You know, it's giving very loose curl pattern dupe almost. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next hair review. Bye guys.